Hi, I'm Madeline, and today I'll be sharing additional ideas on how to get that endorphin rush while letting your body rest. There are many options at different energy levels and for all budgets. The key is to find something that you love to do, that makes you feel positive and expansive, and that brings you joy. Starting with those days with low energy, where you might stay in bed and certainly aren't going to leave home, you can watch a cute or relaxing live nature webcam as I shared in video number 17, practice an uplifting visualization as I shared in videos 20 and 21, watch funny or heartwarming movies and TV shows online, or have a visit from a physically affectionate friend or family member. For days with medium energy, where you can leave the house but need to take it easy, you can visit a high tower, take a tourist gondola up a mountain, go on a giant ferris wheel, hot air balloon, or even take a helicopter ride and just take in the view. Go to a thrilling air show, monster truck rally, or a rodeo. Enjoy a spa treatment, steam room, or massage. Fun, uplifting shows, such as the opera, orchestra, musicals, plays, concerts, comedy clubs, or movies at the theater can inspire you or transport you beyond your current reality. IMAX movies can bring that extra rush. Laugh with friends over a backyard barbecue, games night, or potluck. Volunteer roles exist that don't require a lot of energy, such as information booths or face painting booths. Visit an animal sanctuary, or head to a nearby beach, lake, canyon, mountain, or planetarium, and kick back to enjoy the peace and tranquility. You can also express your creativity through a multitude of hobbies, such as model building, drawing, painting, sculpting, knitting, making jewelry, photography, or creative writing. For days when you have more energy, yet need to avoid overdoing it while you recover from chronic fatigue. You can still enjoy roller coasters and amusement park rides, tandem paragliding, ride in a powerboat, take an easy flat nature hike. And last but not least, don't forget that sex produces endorphins and other feel, feel good hormones. I invite you to create your own list of fun activities. Remember the more fun you are having, the less emotional and mental stress you are focusing on the better your body will be able to heal. If you like this video, you can like, subscribe, and click the link in the description below for my free guide all about the number one most overlooked block to healing from chronic fatigue. Thanks for watching.